Guys, how stunning is my new PJ from Lala Ross? It is so beautiful. Oh my god. And you have to feel the silk material. It is honestly the softest. I'm obsessed. And this royal blue color with this white trim and white buttons. They're like this pearly buttons. It is stunning, stunning, stunning. Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. As you can see, I'm getting ready for tonight's dinner. It is currently around 7, 7.20 p.m. I just got out of the shower. Um, yes, this is my evening get ready with me look. But as you can see from the background behind me, I'm currently on vacation and that's why I've been a little bit MIA here on YouTube. I haven't really posted anything in a while, as well as on my Instagram. And I'm going through a certain phase in my life right now that I will share with you for sure sometime in the future but for now I'm here in Turkey with my whole family with my husband it's our seventh day here and it's incredible and I receive a lot of messages from you guys asking to show you my makeup routine my skincare routine so I have decided to combine it all together and show you everything there is honestly nothing that special about my routine at all hopefully this video will still be interesting it's just a very casual and a very regular get ready with me video and by the way this video is sponsored by lalora so thank you so much lalora for sponsoring today's video how gorgeous is this pajama i love sleeping in it it is so soft and it has so many amazing benefits for your body i always always wanted some silk pjs and every morning because of my other pjs i would wake up and i would have all these marks from my clothing but with this one i don't have any wrinkles on my body afterwards i don't have anything and my body really started to feel a lot silkier a lot healthier my skin is usually very very dry i can actually feel that it's becoming a lot better but of course i do apply some cream at the same time they just both complement each other i think you all need one it's amazing and lalora's prices are so incredibly affordable lalora's have so many beautiful colors a lot of different designs you can choose from i'm going to show them here on the screen um, they also have night gowns like night dresses which are so beautiful as well i just love this very classic look it looks very bougie but at the same time it is pretty affordable and i love it and more amazing things about la ross is that they have a revolutionary prices as i mentioned before the silk pajamas start at just 85 dollars they also offer you a free shipping worldwide 180 days of return and exchange how amazing is that you have like six months to exchange or return your item if you wish to and it is also a washable silk fabric which means that it stays shiny after washing and you don't have to worry about it slippers because you know the floors aren't the cleanest at the hotel and by the way guys i think i filmed a video here last year this is the bathroom at the hotel and i'm not sure if it was this exact room but they're all the same so you have probably seen this background already if you've been following me for a while now but we're in the bathroom let me close all the doors so it looks a little bit more presentable it is kind of messy here but you can't really see what's going on here uh, which is good anyway for now i just need to dry my hair every night it takes about 30 to 40 minutes for me to get ready since i'm on holiday i don't really do much with my face i don't really put a lot of makeup and it's pretty easy to pick an outfit because you know i plan all my outfits in advance so what takes the longest time is definitely taking a shower washing my hair and then drying my hair is the worst but for now i really need to put some after sun cream and i got this tiny little tester that i was given in the shop it's by a brand claron it's been amazing this is the actually the perfect size because i don't apply too much of this product on my face anyway but i need to put some because i don't wear any hat when i swim i like to swim underwater so it's pretty impossible for me to wear any hats on my head to protect my face and i know it's bad but i use the 
SPF 50 and I apply it like every single time I go in the water and whenever I'm at the beach and you know whenever I go to Turkey I eat a lot of baklava and I love it so much so so much it's this Turkish I don't even know how to explain it like pastry thingy but you can google it and you'll find some pictures it is so delicious it's my favorite and i eat it so much here it's with honey so it's really really sweet and my entire face is full of pimples now everywhere even on my eye over here it is so ugly looking but i just cannot stop eating them but anyway i'm glad we're here because the sun and the sea water it all heals my face pretty fast <music> makeup this is my entire makeup bag this is everything i brought with me not too many things because usually i take so much with me and then i never ever use anything the essentials that i really need on my trip are let me show them to you so i've got this sponge applicator i really needed to apply my concealer then here is the concealer i'm using and i use it all the time i use this instead of foundation and i think the coverage is amazing i've stopped using foundation last year once covid hit uh, because I didn't really need makeup and this was enough and right now this is a must-have for me I don't need a foundation anymore I don't like any heavy makeup on my face anymore then I've got this Too Faced mascara a brush this one it's a simple brush from Sephora and then I've got another brush this is also from Sephora for my eyebrows I've got this thingy it's the eyebrow powder I have no idea what the name of the brand is where I got it from but it's a super old one and I dropped it and it fell and it all broke unfortunately but I can still use it for now then i used this laura mercier translucent powder everybody was raving about this powder and i've decided to try it i bought it in dubai and it's amazing let's start with concealer and as i told you before i've got quite a lot of acne on my face i'll just apply it on my pimples basically to cover them a little bit and now you know the shade doesn't really match my skin tone because I got tan and you can clearly see that but I try to blend it as much as I can so it looks okay and then I use that translucent powder and it tones everything down it makes my face a little bit brighter than it actually is and at night nobody can really see because it's really dark outside so that's okay you can still see my pimples I'm not trying to hide them and cover them 100% because then it would mean that I need foundation coverage on my face and I really really don't want that especially here it's very 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 humid outside and you go outside and you get all sweaty and heavy makeup just doesn't look nice here and especially on photos I also really love that it's matte because since I don't use a lot of foundation and I just apply a lot, a lot of creams, after sun creams, my skin looks oily. For my eyebrows, it's very easy to fill in some empty spots and it's pretty easy to create shape. I am not at all a makeup artist i have no idea how to put makeup i just know what works for me and how i like my makeup to look and yeah this is basically what i do every single day this whole thing is so broken it's, it's falling apart i'm trying to be as gentle as i can and lastly i'm gonna put some mascara and usually i also 
do an eyeliner but I'm just not feeling it here there is no need for an eyeliner since I'm on holiday can you see it looks so much better already my eyelashes are not very long and you can't really see them because my eyes does this ever happen to you <laughs> Okay, I'll fix it later because my eyes are pretty dark so they sort of like blend in together You can't really see my eyelashes and my eyes look bold If I don't put anything on them I'm not really careful with the application because I know I can fix it afterwards But I let it dry first When it's dry, it's easier to remove it from your face And I also brought a few lipstick so depending on the outfit i want to wear today i'm going to choose either this one from hermes i don't really use it on a daily basis that much but it's this one i have probably showed it to you already it's number 40 it's called rose lipstick and then there is another one that i have it's this one it is Too faced lip injection extreme it's a really good one. I really, really love it. And this is my complete look. I'll still need to apply some lipstick. And now I need to choose what I want to wear. So I still haven't worn this t-shirt with my Louis skirt. I still have this Zimmerman dress over here that I haven't worn. Um, this is my beach dress it's from a brand called Camila and it's so beautiful i still haven't worn this one but today is a very casual dinner so i don't think i need to wear anything fancy i want to keep these dresses for our next hotel we are moving in two days i'm very excited so i think today i'm just gonna go casual i think i'll put on some shorts and a t-shirt that's the easiest i need something that I don't need to iron because I don't have time for that. It's pretty late already. And now I need to choose the shoes. I'm so proud of myself because um, this three pairs and then uh, that one pair are the only shoes that I brought with me on this trip. And we are staying here for about 16 days, maybe 17 days. So I'm very proud of myself. I was very tactical with what I'm taking. Uh, very strategic and i think for the outfit i'm wearing tonight i'm gonna go with this bottega black um, padded sandals or maybe i could use this ones because they're so cool i just love them so so much i am obsessed with the shoes during this whole trip i think i wore them the most but i also really love this chanel ones they're so comfy anyway i think i'm gonna go with this one so let me quickly get dressed and i'll show you the final look i'm all dressed up the light in here is so bad i swear because of this lamp right above me but this is my look today i also added a few accessories so i'm wearing my van cleef lucky alhambra necklace my vintage alhambra earrings i've decided not to go for the long earrings because my outfit is pretty casual and my black shorts last thing i need to add is wait where is it i'm not taking a bag i'm just not using my bags here i don't need them so i'll use my carmex i need it all the time to hydrate my lips because they are very very dry and so it looks nicer i'm gonna use this lip injection by Too faced it is so amazing i love this lip gloss and i've also noticed that once i arrived here i'm not sure what it is is it the sun is it the fruits that i eat here or what it is but my lips they look a lot brighter usually they look very very pale and i really need to add some tint to them so i don't look sick but here they always look pinkish and i love it i love my natural lip color i think it's so pretty and voila this is my finished look and forgot to show you one last thing that i want to wear today is one of these beautiful masks um which color should i go for I have quite a few colors here 
but I think the best ones are this three so black gold and white so I'll put this ones till next time and let's check in the mirror all three look really really good but I kind of love the gold one it just looks so pretty I love it let's try it on and see if it looks good with my t-shirt Oh my god, yes, this is the one. It looks so amazing with this t-shirt. This was a very casual video that a lot of you guys requested, so I really hope you enjoyed it. And thanks again, Lalo Ross, for sponsoring today's video, and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye!